So this whole time I've just been needing to connect to myself. And all it's been is just a certain aspect to believing in myself. That's it. That's all it's been. This whole time. All these years. All these years I thought that in order to drop in order to drop my sp spirituality or whatever I had to drop that part of myself I had to just like well let's throw away your self esteem because it I just it was like intertwined and I just every time I looked at it uh when people would mention something that would make me think about, you know, well, what if, <clears throat> what if these things really are, just now, I just had one of those, those thoughts that go through my mind of, uh, uh, oh, that's one of those, look, you're thinking, look at how all this stuff happened, oh, that's, it. something happened the way it was meant to be, and it must be, in a, like, what, stop that, um, uh, I mean, who knows, maybe there's some sort of path that everyone's on and everything's on this static thing, but we don't know that. Um, I'd like to think that I have a free will. Um, but I thought that, that in order to separate those things, I would have to go back to, I would have to literally put my entire mindset back to when I was in... Uh, you know, you know, you know, like when I was 12 or something and I thought I'd have to like start everything over from when I was 12 Yeah, I, I thought it would be by the time someone reaches my age You know the, the There's certain parts of your brain that just are that are, are, are They're just at that point. They're going to be thinking a certain way and I think it's probably more by like the age of 30 that that sort of thing really starts to happen. And this idea of completely reprogramming my brain and having to start way back was just so foreboding. And uh, those sorts of thoughts were going through my mind every so often. And, uh, and then, like in my this last that last video, it just suddenly clicked. It's just like, well, this whole time, this whole time, I've been just connecting to myself. What's, what is uh, <laughs> I mean, I, I, <laughs> I, I was almost crying just a little bit ago, not because I'm sad, but because. I mean, I guess there's a little bit of sadness because I, I, I feel that I, I wasted so much of my life thinking that, that the only way to, uh, I, I don't know, I mean, like, I, I'm just think about, like, with my music, it's like, well, it's from me, it's all from me, the music's all from me, it's not, it's not, it's not, I mean, I, I just, this, I, <laughs> I didn't think it would be a, 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 a something to make me feel better about myself. I wasn't expecting that. I, I wasn't. I, 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 I'm just, I, I'm, I'm still, I, I am in shock. I'm in shock. I, all this time that I've tried so hard to be an atheist, it was the most painful thing for me. It was so painful because it felt like it meant that I had to just toss away some of myself. I think an important thing, if people have a dialogue with someone 
and they bring up the element of the feeling of connect the connection with God that if it really boils down to it it should be said that they're really connecting with themselves and they should have a better self-esteem I just can't believe how much better I feel and this is this is weird this is weird because it's I, I I I completely expected the opposite result on this I just this is weird